she did have two guys in mind for me. The first she introduced me to, <laughs> I kind string. of had to pull her aside and say, <laughs> yeah, that, that's definitely not me. Then she said, well, we're going to go to Plan B, and Plan B was to meet Todd. She said, I have a girl for you to meet, and I said, sounds wonderful, let's do it. I thought she was very beautiful, and I was eager to talk to her, but I was a little shy and timid. I think I didn't come off that way. I, think mm. I came off a little arrogant. I thought he was obnoxiously confident <laughs> and an abundance of ego. But he was funny and witty. Mr. Confident came over. I think he slapped me on the butt, tried to give me a kiss or something. It was just like, <laughs> we went from zero to 60 in 2.2, and I had to shut him down. <laughs> it was a perfect, great, great first date, but also very different. I'd never been on a first official date before where it had been like that intimate and that you know, close. Smooth. Our first official kiss, he was waiting for me outside of the restroom and... Give her a kiss. It was a very nice, passionate kiss right outside the restroom. But yeah, had to. I want him there and everything that I do. We just enjoy each other's company. She's the most fun person I've ever been around in my life, and she's my best friend. I think he is absolutely my best friend. Not to mention she's hot. And I thought, oh wow, this is so exciting. And then it hit me, oh crap, we're going up in a hot air balloon. <laughs> Oh my god. <laughs> Which is exactly what I wanted to happen. So the staff escorted us to the private balloon. Started taking off. My heart is racing a mile a minute. Did some scenery looking for a little bit, and then as we started ascending, then I kind of gave him a little hand signal, and then they started opening the banner. So then I had her look to the left while they were opening it up, and then I had her look down to the right. And so I turn around and I look. I see people are down below, and I can certainly see that somebody's holding something, but I don't know what it says. Mind you, it was a huge banner. That it said, I love you, Susan. Will you marry me? And I turn back around, and he's on his knee, and he's got the ring box open, and I just started just tearing up, and I immediately lunged for him. And she just grabbed me and brought me really, really close and said yes, like seven times. Poor thing didn't get a chance to really officially say anything at all. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just glad she said yes. It would have been an awkward bride if she would have said no.